The sheer number of Americans applying now for unemployment are soaring. A record 3.3 million filed just last week alone. Here to explain how this is playing out in our state is our political editor, Dennis Welch. Dennis? Yeah, and unfortunately, just like the rest of the country, we are seeing unprecedented numbers of Arizona workers here losing their job. Now, the numbers here so high that it appears now to overwhelm the state's ability to respond to this crisis right now. We could need an additional 13,000 hospital beds and an additional 1,500 ICU beds. With state health That's officials warning that we are at the, the beginning of this public health crisis, the toll that the coronavirus has taken on our economy is already staggering. They just said they're having extreme lot of people call in. Like tens of thousands of workers in Arizona, Larry Coleman just lost his job and needed money. But he says it took him nearly two days to file for unemployment. You're unemployed, and then they, everything with this bonus virus, you need your money, and it's just like there's nobody there to get a hold of. In the span of just eight days starting last week, more than 52,000 Arizona workers filed for unemployment insurance. The high demand reportedly crashed the state's website and jammed up phone lines leaving workers like Coleman twisting in the wind. We are equipped to handle this. this the governor says they have responded by adding more servers and staff at the Department of Economic Security. We're going to work overtime to make sure that people are getting their benefits and we're being responsive. But yes, the, the technology of, of everything inside state government is being challenged. Meanwhile, the state is no longer providing daily updates on unemployment claims. And Governor Ducey still has not unveiled his economic recovery plan that he's been promising for days. So I'm trying to find work here locally, but if not, I'll have to go back out on the road and work. Now, there is some positive news for those workers out there that have lost their jobs or seen their hours slash at this point. Now, that $2 trillion stimulus that is about to be passed by Congress, it would include an extra $600 a week for unemployment benefits. So what does that mean for uh, somebody here in Arizona filing for unemployment? It would bring that total weekly payment up to about $840 a week because, remember, Arizona caps its unemployment payments at just $240 a week, which is the second lowest in the country. Guys, I'll send it back into you. And those uh, filings have really spiked. Okay, Dennis Welch, our political editor. Thank you.